So this time we're going to talk about patterns. I'm going to take x and assign it a, a, a series of values. The pattern will be 1 to 4. I'm going to put another command on this line. Right after it assigns that to x, I'm going to tell it to key in the value of x. Then I'll print it all out. That's nice. So you can have multiple commands on one line. Just have to be semicolon delimited. Next, I'm going to repeat the number 4. How many times? Well, the times I want to repeat it will equal 6. That's nice. I like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Very good. Now I'm going to get a sequence of numbers. From where to where? Well, from... Let's see. I want it to be... The beginning will equal negative 8. And uh, where do you want to take these numbers to? To the number, oh, I don't know. Let's say it's equal to 12. And I want to jump every, by how much? By, uh, let's see, a number that's equal to 4. So start with negative 8, jumps by 4, until it gets to up till and up to it and up till it gets to twelve. Yeah, that's it. Bingo, there it goes. Negative eight. Plus four, negative four, plus four, four is zero, plus four is four, plus four is eight, plus four is twelve. And then it's done. That is just incredible. Last but not least in our patterns. I want a sequence of numbers, starting from negative 2 all the way to 3. That's it. That's a simple one. And there they go. Negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. And it stops. And now it's time for me to stop. This is George Bull saying bye-bye.